In this video, we're going to look at an overview of purchase order revision levels. It's a feature from the Manufacturing Power Pack by Willowware. PO revision levels enables tracking item revision levels on a PO line. It tracks the revision level of the part at the time it was ordered, supports tracking a history of revision level changes per PO line, and supports ordering the same part at different revision levels on the PO. Let's head into Dynamics GP to see how we set this functionality up. I'm going to come to Microsoft Dynamics GP, Tools, Setup, Manufacturing, Manufacturing Power Pack Setup. I need to find my feature from the list and, che and just check it off. Then select the Done button. We're being warned that the changes that we've just applied are only going to affect our login. Other users must restart Dynamics GP for the changes to take effect. The way that purchase order revision levels works is it looks at the manufacturing card, the item engineering data card, to see what our current revision level is for our item. Let's head there now. Cards, Manufacturing, Inventory, Engineering data. Let's select an item and review its revision level. We can see that this multi-core processor currently has a revision level of 5. Let's go order this item. Transactions, Purchasing, Purchase order entry. I'm going to get my next PO number, enter my vendor, select my item, and enter the quantity I'd like to purchase. Now I'm going to come to additional PO line rev numbers. We can see that the engineering rev that's listed here matches what we just saw in the manufacturing card. Maybe I'd like to order an older revision level in order to support my service department. So let's order revision level 2. And we'll put a comment down here that we know we're ordering this for our service group. And then click Save. Now when I print the purchase order, I'm going to be able to see that that PO rev level is on the PO. I've highlighted it in red for us so that it's easy for us to see. PO rev level 2. Perhaps I've made a mistake though, and maybe I should have actually ordered revision level number 3. I'm going to go back into my PO, select my line item, additional, PO line rev numbers, and in here I can see that my engineering revision level is still set to 5. The current rev on the PO is 2, but I'm going to order number 3. and enter another comment and save it. Again, when I print the PO, I'm going to be able to witness that that change has taken place. My PO now will print with revision number 3. Even if someone goes back into that manufacturing card and updates the revision, it's not going to have any effect on my PO. Let's pull up that item number and move it to revision level 6 and click Save. Let's go back to our purchase order. Select our, our line item. And now we can see that the current engineering revision level is set to 6. The initial rev when we created this PO was 5. Our current rev is 3. But we can also see that at one point we actually ordered revision level 2 in the scrolling window down below. I could put up a second line item for the same part number and order a different revision level and it would work in the same manner. This concludes Purchase Order Revision Levels by Willowware.